Hello again. Um, here's I came across one more thing that I like to do personally before I put a new set of heads on an engine, especially one that's got bigger valves. So I went from a 205 intake valve to a 208. So what I like to do is I wad up just a blob of plasticine. You can get this at the dollar store or whatever. If you got kids, you've probably got some laying around the house. And I like to put it in the valve relief of the piston. And then that way, when I put the head on, put some lifters in, push rods, rocker arms. Um, I know the exhaust valve is not going to be an issue because it's the same size as the old ones and they never touched. So I just put the blob here in the intake relief cut of the number one piston. And then as you can see, how close it comes down into the piston there. So I just wanted to make sure that the bigger valve wasn't going to be hitting right here in my piston. Like 30,000 isn't much, but it could be enough to hit, but I just wanted to make sure. So you put the plasticine in the piston, put your head on. I don't put it down tight and I don't put a gasket on just so you're not wrecking your head gasket. And then just snug it up. It doesn't have to be tight. Um, lash your valves, roll the engine over two times because once will be your exhaust valve and then once will be your intake. And then take everything off and then you can inspect your plasticine here. And another thing to add too is once you have your head gasket on there, the head gasket I'm using will give me an additional 39 thousandths gap between the cylinder head and the piston. So what I've got here is plenty of room so I don't have to worry about the piston coming in contact with the valve. I've probably got just a shade less than a quarter inch there. So yeah, it's probably gonna be about a quarter inch with the head gasket on. So everything checks out good. I just wanted to run through that. Just It's what I do as a, just kind of a dummy check to make sure that everything's good before final assembly. Cause it sucks when you put it together and you crank it over and you bend all of your valves, push rods, damage your pistons, even your heads if you start it. So. Better safe than sorry. Hope this helps. Till next time.